everybody. Welcome to today's perf stripping video. Oh, and this eyebrow's looking real good. Yeah, I tried something new and it's a fail. Whatever, whatever. Hey guys, hey, welcome to today's video. I've got, we're doing, you know, back to basics. We're going to do this thing like we always have in the past where but these other videos I've done are just so freaking random and it's like, Oh, it's a, it becomes a pain in the butt if we don't stick to basics, right? So that's what we're going to do today. We're going to have a fun Friday, you guys. And I've got some really great bags because I just got back from Savers again. Yes, Savers did, did me good again today. It was a beautiful day at Savers. And the past couple days actually have been very, very good. So I can't wait to share with you everything I have. I'm cleaning off a bag right now. Hey, ladies. Is there any gentlemen? Nope. All ladies here today. Welcome, welcome. Hope you guys are doing fantastic. Um, before I start to sell my bags, I'm going to get the disclaimer out that all my items are pre-owned. None of them are in perfect condition unless otherwise stated. So if you're not happy with uh, the way they look here, please ask all questions before purchasing because all sales are final. No exchanges, no returns, nothing. Once you purchase it, it's all yours. Um, all my bags will be listed below this video for sale and instructions on how to pay. So that's about it, you guys. I do U.S. shipping only, and it's just we're going to have a lot of fun today because I have some great bags. If there's anything behind me you want to see, please let me know. Not this one, though. This is my daughter's. I picked this up. I'll just go ahead and show you. This is my baby girls. This is she. She may be a nurse practitioner. She may be almost 30 years old, but this is I'm telling you guys, you got to stay young. Um, when she was just a little tiny thing, two years old, she used to sing the um, little Ariel song and it was so precious. And it's one of her very favorite Disney movies. So I actually <clears throat> I actually thrifted this for $24.99 last week, I believe. It's by Loungefly. And I looked it up, and these are $125 now. So I called her up. I'm like, hey, Noni, which is her nickname. I said, hey, Krista. She's not really a purse girl, but when she saw this, she's like, yes, I want it. So it's so stinking cute. It's so adorable. And this is going to be hers. Brand, brand new condition. So this one, you guys, is not for sale. So I'm going to go ahead and put this down here because that's for my baby. And what's really weird, you guys, when she does her hair, I should show you a picture. Let me show you. She looks like this. She looks like Eric. Let me show you if I can find a picture real quick. It's so cool. Probably should go on to, let's see, Facebook is probably where I'll find her picture. Let's see here. Let's see. Let's see. Ew, I don't want to look at that ugly face. Let's see. Um, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's get her did here. Okay, now let me find a picture of her all done up. You'll be like, oh, maybe she does look a little bit like Ariel. Oh, I, I, uh, yeah, I did. I FaceTimed her and she loves it. And she's not a purse girl, so I was really excited. All right, where's your pictures, girlfriend? Let's see. Photos. She's got a million photos of her. Her kitty cat. Okay, look. Tell me this does not Let me hide any information. That's my daughter. I'll try to get the, I don't want you to have to see the ring light. Ah, okay, that's my daughter. And look at, right? She is Ariel. My daughter is Ariel, you guys. Isn't she beautiful? My baby girl. My beautiful, beautiful bestie, my baby girl. I think, um, you think years back you have her, yeah, um, I do have her nursing graduation. It's, I, I'm not sure if it's still up there or not. That's when she got her, um, she became an RN. Now she just graduated and she's a nurse practitioner. So proud mama right here. Proud, proud mama. Yes, yeah, she is beautiful inside and out. Is my baby. Is my baby girl. So this is her little purse. So um, I know yesterday I had some people asking questions about different bags that were back here. So if you want, if you want me to get started with something you see back here, just let me know and we shall get started on that. 
make sure I didn't miss anything. Make sure you guys also ask any questions that you might have. My other little bestie sitting here with me. Pixie, you want to come up with mama? Come here. You want to come with mommy up here? Come here. I got your blanket. Let's see. Blue bag. Okay, this is the one I showed yesterday. This is a Tiffany blue bag. So we'll go ahead and list this below after the video. I'll list it below. This is Tiffany blue. Um, it is Safiano leather and it is by Tianeo or Tiganello or however you pronounce it. It's in brand new condition. And what's really cool is the Safiano leather uh, Tianeos are few and far between. They're really few and far between. Um, this is a gorgeous tote style bag. So your strap drop is nice and long. It has a front pocket and it has a back pocket and it's got rolled leather handles. It's got two zipper pulls and this is what's really cool. If you didn't see it yesterday, it's got gussets on the side. So it opens up extremely wide and you have tons and tons of organization on the inside. That's the Tianeo label right there, a zipper, another zipper. Those are 12 credit card slots right there. I think you can see things much better here than you did yesterday, which is a good thing because yesterday was a bomb video. It was not bomb meaning not good. Um, it bombed. It was just like, because I went to show you guys just a couple things and it ended up just being like very crappy video. So anyways, this is really pretty. Like I said, it's a Tiffany blue and it is going to be listed below when you guys are ready. Okay. Um, let's see what else we're going to go ahead. And I just thrifted this little cutie pie. I found this little Michael Kors double zip and it's the smaller version of the handbag. It's in black Safiano leather. It does have the crossbody strap with it, the two double zip straps, leather rolled handles, and then you get all of your pockets. Let me take the price tag out. There's your pockets. This is a key lanyard that was at the bottom here. Still gotta, I still gotta clean this one out. It's got a little bit of dust in here. I just picked it up. I literally just got it. So this is black. And then you also have your zipper pocket here. And then it gussets on the side with little snaps. Just cinch it in. And this is the smaller version. Um, I do not have a larger version right now. They, these sell out really, really fast for me. Are you putting prices up at the end? Yes, I'm going to put the prices up at the end underneath the video. Um, it just works better for all of us. And then maybe someday I'll do another auction, but not right away because it's stress, it stresses us all out. So, and that's not what I, what I want to do to you guys. So, oh, that's just a little bit of white that can be just cleaned off. So if you guys want this one, this is Michael Kors little black Safiano, Safiano satchel and um, it's gold tone hardware. Okay, well, let's do this. I got this today too. Let's look at this Brighton wallet, you guys. This is one of their really, really cool wallets. It's got the, it's Safiano leather and it's got like the little print on it. It's so cute. It says shopping list. It's just adorable. Looks like it's got a little keychain on it, and that says Grand Hotel. Okay, and then the back looks like this. It's in excellent condition, it says Brighton, and then it's got a slip pocket. Happy Friday, Ellen. I'm so happy it's Friday today. I really am. And then it opens up all the way. It's in beautiful new condition, and the interior is blue leather. It's adorable, right? So we have this pocket, and then one, two, three, four slip pockets, and then there's all of this extra card slots. So it's got lots of cool stuff. What I love about 
Brighton, and it also has an ID window, is they're so creative with where they put their card slots and extra this and extra that. And yeah, this is a about $198 wallet retail, and it is in excellent new condition. Okay, so that's going... That's going to go quick. Oh, I wanted to show you this right here is like a silver metallic leather. Just that little area right there. So adorable. Um, got this today. Holy heck, what a find. For all my winter bugs out there, if you want a winter bag, here you go. Look at this. Look at this. Isabella Fiore. I was so excited when I found this, you guys. This is Isabella Fiore. It is leather, woven leather. It has um, like little woven, um, I can't explain it, like a sweater material right there. Actually like a crochet. I'd say more of a crochet. And it is in black. Look at the adorable little puffy balls on each side. Super pretty. This is so gorgeous, isn't it? And all the detail on both back and front it's all leather black leather and it's antique brass here's the bottom okay and then it's a magnetic snap closure here's your little isabella fiore hang tag and then the inside is beautiful this has like never been used this is i don't think this has ever been used so the inside is navy blue with some slip pockets and then it's got the center zip leather trimmed pouch. Okay, so there's your leather trimmed pouch. And then this side over here has the Isabella Fiori pocket. And this little guy is little it's a medium to large size it's not little by any means but there you have it and i just want you to see all the detail up close how pretty this is isn't it pretty you guys pebbled leather okay so that's my isabella fiore Fits very comfortably, nice long strap drop. Nice and big, very, very pretty. Okay, so this can be either used as a purse or a travel bag. Um, denim is super, super in right now. Anything's vintage looking. This is not a vintage piece, but it is adorable. It's by Steve Madden. And it's a denim acid wash, either like a handbag or a tote because it's got the two little handles here or wear it as a tote. And it's got really cute detail on it with the little twist lock closures on each side of the opening. Sorry, baby, I didn't need to hit you. So it's got two nickel denim hardware closures on the outside. It's got this zipper pocket. The inside, inside feels like a suede material. Dawn, thank you. Thank you so much. I so appreciate that, you guys, so much. I actually am taking whatever, um, whenever I get Super Chats, I'm taking it and I'm setting it aside. And I'm doing like special little things um, like I will try, I'm trying to get little special things for giveaways or maybe I'll get myself a coffee or something that makes me feel good. So thank you so much, John. I really, really appreciate that. Okay, so um, Jenny, look at this. It takes up the whole screen if you want this one. <laughs> I am not kidding when I say it's big. Okay, so and then when you carry it like a purse though, it like short, it's small, it gets smaller. It's just so cute. And then you just undo the little twist locks. Tie-dye, yes. Yeah, tie-dye, acid wash, kind of kind of in between maybe. But yeah, I agree. And then look at the inside. Brand new. 
It's got the leather lined pocket by Steve Madden. Am I right? Yeah, Steve Madden. And the whole interior is just super, super soft, like a like a microfiber suede kind of material. It's great. This is a great purse. And then you've also got two slip pockets over here. Girl, if this thing was leather, it literally would weigh about 30 pounds because <laughs> it's so big. So there you go. That's the Steve Madden acid wash purse. Um, let's do this, which I just got today as well. This brand spanking new condition coach crossbody. And it's in black signature. It's like a sateen material with this adorable chain. And it's got the little coach hang tag on it. Um, black leather bottom. You can use this as a crossbody or you can arrange it to where you can shorten the handle by unlooping it and cinching it through and make it a shoulder bag as well. There's the back. And then it's got a nice zipper pull on it, silver hardware. And this is in brand spanking new condition. I don't even think it's ever been worn by the way the material is on the inside as well. There is the Creed. This is a zipper. And then two open pockets. Okay, so brand, brand new condition, not even a scratch on it. Oh, think, you know what? I will. I think actually I will. I will take it and I will get myself an iced coffee while I work tomorrow. So thank you, sweetie. Thank you. Like I need another coach. You can never have too many coaches, you guys. Never have too many coaches or purses in general, right? Um, let's see. Do I have any questions on any of the bags yet? Just want to make sure I get to your questions before I move on. Hi, Barbara. Hello, hello. Are you hot bugs? Are you hot bugs? Okay. How about this for my little bag, ladies? I have something extremely adorable. And I got this purse. I go to this um, one thrift shop. It's just this little tiny place. And it's all proceeds go to pet adoption. Because I'm very, very big on donating and um, donating time, money, whatever I can to um, shelters. And I'm trying to get the price tag off. Shelters and things like that. And when I went there, you guys, they had, I think I purchased nine pet adoption or nine Brighton bags at this little pet adoption place. So this is what it looks like. It's kind of like a, it's definitely a, can you do this? Let's see. It doesn't stay there. Okay. So it's, it's definitely a little tote style, but it's small. Um, it's got this adorable little charm set on it. And it's in brand new condition. It has the heart hang charm. It's got faux croc. It's real leather, but faux croc embossed. It's not real crocodile. Um, there's your silver charm. And then it's got this adorable little heart charms. I'm a sucker for charms. So there's all the little charms that come on it. And then look at this, guys. So it opens up. And it opens up super big. And you can fit tons of stuff in this. Isn't it adorable? I love this thing. It's so cute. There's the Brighton Creed. Oh, yay, Jenny. I'm glad you love it. And then it just, whoop, it cinches up. So the more stuff you put in it, the less it will cinch and the bigger it will look. So I thought that was quite the amazing little bag. And hope somebody will love it as much as I do. And it also has like a little um, adjustment on the strap, a little tiny adjustment. It's just too cute with black pebbled leather. And I just think it's adorable. Okay, let's do, I need to get you guys some bigger names in here. 
But first we'll do this little cutie pie. This is one that I just love to death. Um, was there a name on this one? I don't remember seeing a name on this one, but absolutely adorable nonetheless. It screams fall. It's so cute. It's all leather. And this is like a copper leather. And it's got little uh, rhinestone stud flowers on it. And it's just a little like a small tote. It's got a cute little tassel zipper pull. And it's got uh, a nice slipper slip pocket on the front. And one on the back. It opens up nice and wide. It's very, very clean in like new condition. Brighton will last you a lifetime. If you're only into getting one bag at, you know, over a few years, Brighton will last you for years. Just like Fossil, Lucky Brands, um, Hobo International. Yeah, Brighton's one of those. So I love the detail on this. It's got nickel hardware or brushed silver, whichever you want to call it. And it's just adorable. Let me show you up close. You can't really tell, but these are really cute little rhinestones and studs. Okay, so we're going to call this my rhinestone leather tote. Okay, so the zipper works fine. And there you have it. So my rhinestone little leather tote. Um, let's do this coat. <coughs> This is a vintage, red vintage tote by Coach. And it's in a lipstick red color. It does have markings because it's vintage piece, silver hardware. And the, <clears throat> it is a large bag. It does have one little, like a little watermark right there. Okay, opens up. The inside looks um, whoop, looks amazing. And here is the Creed. Can you tell me how much is the red bag behind you? If you'd like, I will show it to you, and then I'll have it listed after the video is over. You can check back after the video is over, but I don't give prices out during the video. But yeah, I can do that. So this is the red coach, and it's a large one, definitely large. Everybody needs a red bag. Supposedly, it brings really good luck too. So get yourself a red bag. Okay, so you want to see this one. This is a DKNY, and this is in brand new condition. It's a red quilted leather with the top handles, satchel style, gold tone hardware, very, very soft leather. Feet on the bottom. There's the little DKNY emblem in gold tone hardware. Let's see, am I getting that okay? This is a pure lipstick red, and it feels like a lambskin, actually. Very soft. And then it's got a taupe Safiano leather top. You can take off the uh, long strap if you like. And then the inside is a satin DKNY emblem material. It's super clean. And let's see, those are pockets. And then you have your zipper pocket. And it still has the little silica packets in it. That's when you know the bag has probably never been used is when you find a new looking bag with silica packets. So there you go. If you're interested in that one that will be listed, it will now be listed below after uh, my video is up, after my live is over. Oh, thank you, Linda. This place is a hot freaking mess right now, and I am not kidding when I say hot mess. So we'll put this over here. 
Um, let's see. We will do... Shoot me a name brand, you guys, and I'll see if I have it. This one here. Do you want to see this one? This one needs some love. This one I will list, but... Um, it needs to be restitched. It's still intact, but it needs to be restitched right here. Move this around. It needs to be restitched right there where the little loop connects to the bag. And it could use it over here as well where the stitching is coming out. But it's a little vintage um, Faketa leather bucket bag. Very cute crossbody strap or shoulder strap. Okay, and then it's vintage because you unbuckle it. And then it's got the little cinch tie like a bucket bag. And then here is the interior, nice and clean. So if you want this, I will list it for what I paid for it. When I bought it, I didn't check it close enough for the stitching. Um, you may know somebody or you may be able to fix it yourself. So I'm just gonna list it for what I paid. And then if whoever wants it can grab it and you're gonna have an adorable bag if you want to just stitch the little areas on the side. So we're gonna hook that back up here and put that with the bags that are now going to be listed for sale. There's no name, Irene, there's no name on this. So we're just gonna call it the Vaquetta bucket bag, okay? There's no name on it at all. No embossed anything. So, yeah, no name. But it is genuine leather for sure. Um, you can go to a cobbler. If you have a cobbler, like somebody that fixes shoes, um, some um, cleaners can fix it. It just depends what's in your area. But if you have a, a shoe place in your area, then they definitely fix leather bags. Perfect. Then it will be perfect for you if you have somebody. And it cost me about, it just depends on the bag. For me, this would probably cost me like 15 bucks for him to fix. Um, so I don't know what your guy would cost. They go anywhere from like $5 up. Is That's what it's costed, has costed in the past, has cost in the past. So let's do this really pretty little coach wallet. This is brand new condition as well. Um, this is a walk wallet on a chain and it is in gorgeous brand new condition. I literally said I was gonna keep it. I put my stuff in it and said, nope, it's not for me. Um, but it is a gorgeous, gorgeous walk by coach. So it's got the leather and these on it. It's got a great size pocket back here. It fits a phone, a large phone, just fine if you have one larger than the 8 Plus, which I think most people do now. Um, I'm very behind the times in that situation. But it fits perfect. It's very heavy. And then it twist locks. And you have lots of card slots, zipper compartment, and it's embossed coat right here. And then there's also another pocket. So if you'd like this, perfect condition. And then you guys can see that you just unlock, untake that off, undo it, whatever. And then just stick this in your purse if you want as a regular wallet. Catch and release. Alrighty, I don't, I don't see anything coming through on requests, so let's see, what else do I want to do? Do you guys want me to keep going? I'm sure you do. You're going to say, yeah, I already know that. Uh, let's see. What, what does anybody want right now? Right, Barbara? So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to check my phone real quick because I thrifted an amazing wallet. And before I show it, I wanna make sure it's authentic. And you guys let me know what you wanna see. Okay, I have a B. Mikowski. I'll check my wallet later because yes, 
<clears throat> I do have a B. Mikowski bag. Ouch. Plus, I gotta show you a purse I bought myself, too. Okay, let's see. B. Mikowski, you are right here. All right, Joey, I have B. Mikowski for you. I only have one, and this is the best one. This is so cute. It's black, smooth leather, like a glove leather. It's got these little ruched front pockets. It has the foam slip in the back, two ruched side pockets, and silver hardware. And uh, there are the on the bottom zip top closure. I know, isn't it cute? So cute, right? Come here, baby doll. Okay, let's move the pedal. All right, um, it's got a zipper top closure, smooth as butter. This really cool interior with lots of pockets. And the best part is the braided leather um, shoulder straps. Nice drop. Isn't it cute? So it's in brand new condition, by the way, if you're interested. This is the only B. Mikowski that I have. Um, any crossbodies the size of the coach I just showed? I do. I have Kate Spade. Hi, Ruby. Hold on. I'll grab. I have so many little bags. Where are you? Oh, let's do this vintage coach crossbody. You know what? I'm going to throw in this vintage bad boy right now. Looksy, looksy, this is vintage coach crossbody in black and in beautiful, beautiful condition. It has a pocket on the back that's all suede interior. And then, yeah, they really are, Dawn, if you, if you get a good one for sure. Here is the flap. And this bag was made in the U.S. of A. So that's a pocket. And then your main pocket. And this is, uh, the Creed is right here. And it is, it is right there. It's stamped in here. And this is made in the U.S.A. Zipper pocket. And yeah, beautiful vintage coach. Let's see, it opens up nice and wide. Well, not totally wide, but that's what it looks like on the side. And it has um, antique brass hardware. This is antique brass. Yeah, antique brass hardware. Okay. Oh, really? Hey, some people will pay it. I would, too, if I knew somebody would pay it. It's what you got. It's what you do as a reseller. You get the best you can, the best profit you can on for your time, your effort, your gas. There's a lot to reselling. It's not just like, la, 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 let me get this person and sell it. It's There's a lot to it. Let's see. What have I missed, if anything? Okay. All right. Um, any more requests, you guys?
why you're doing that. If I don't see any comments, I'm going to check this wallet. Okay, let me check this. Let me check this. Louis Vuitton. Louis Vuitton. Um, number on this is. Where'd you go, number? I saw you earlier. Where'd you go, man? You used to resell purses many years ago. Was known locally as the purse lady. That's cool. Let's see. All right, where'd you go? I literally saw the number on this when I bought it. Or did you switch wallets on me? It was like right here. Where'd it go? You guys, I'm losing my mind. Because I think I found an authentic Louis Vuitton. But I'm not going to show it unless I know it's real because you can't do that stuff here. Um, come on, really? Let me get my light. Let me get my flashlight out. Did you guys know that? You're not allowed to show unauthentic pieces. Um, you'll go to YouTube jail quicker than you could scream. YouTube jail. All right, well, I'm going to have to do further research in a minute because it was friggin' here when I bought it. And now I don't find it. I think it's because I'm in a rush and I'm looking over it. Oh, is it in here? Really, Kim? Check the inside flap of the wallet. There's no flap, honey. There's not a flap. And I literally saw the um, the number. I was like, yeah, I'll take it. And she's like, is there a number? And I said, yeah, it's right there. And I showed it to her. <laughs> what the heck, yo? What a goofball. I'm, I'll find it. It's in here. I just don't know why I'm having issues with it right now. If it's authentic, you guys, I'll show it to you later. Um, maybe it's in there or in there. It started with an M. I remember that. Ridiculous. Nope, it's not the coin zip. Okay, so. Um, well, hi, Kim Rogers from Arkansas. That's really annoying. Because as soon as I picked it up, I was like, yep, there's the number. Really annoying. Oh, there's the number. I found it. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. I found it. Okay, now let me go back to Google and do in seven six. Okay, let's see what the research tells us. Hot diggity damn, it's real, you guys. Let me look at all the pictures before I show to make it. It's real. It's real. It is the real deal. It is the real deal. Show images. This is the Louis Vuitton monogram zippy wallet, round zipper wallet, M60017. Authentic piece, you guys. It is authentic. Here is the code. Now watch. Probably can't find it again because I'm just a loser like that. Really? Where did I just see? <laughs> oh, there it is. There's the code right there. Here is, let me look at all the stitching. Images. Open it up. 
Zipper is correct. And I got this for 30% off of $49.99. Um, let's see what else. The zipper is correct. This zipper is correct. Thank you, Jenny. I'm so excited. This is a really nice wallet. Um, let me see here on the reverse side of this zipper. That is correct. Everything's correct on this, you guys. This is an authentic, authentic piece. And it's brand, well, almost brand new condition. There's like very, very little wear on the zipper pull. That's, sorry about that. Show you up close. Awesome, right? All right, you guys. So somebody asked for fossil. I'll get you a fossil. I have a fossil crossbody, and it is gorgeous. It is in like new condition as well. Has fossil stamped at the bottom. Has antique brass hardware. And has a nice big open pocket with a zipper and open pockets. Oh, yay, Don! Don, have you had any dates lately? <laughs> go have fun with karaoke. Are you going to go with the hot guy? Okay. It's a really a smooth, beautiful, smooth leather. Karaoke is fun. I'm too, I'm too, can you believe I have, I have, do not have the ovaries to do that at all. I can't, I will not do karaoke. I'm too, too shy, if you can believe that. And then it's got the really nice um, crossbody attachment. And it's in like new condition if anybody wants it. So that's going to be today's purse sale. I think that was pretty stinking good. Um, I'm going to figure out how much I want to sell this for if I decide to sell it. Sturdy wallet. It's a nice one. And yeah, everything else that was shown today is going to be on the video underneath in the description box. Your mom would love the Louis Vuitton wallet for her birthday. Oh, I bet. I would love a Louis Vuitton for, in, for my birthday too. <laughs> I'll just say happy birthday to me, Kim. Yeah, I like that. It's cool. I do. I have a beautiful voice. Just kidding. <laughs> I don't sing that I, that, I, that I know of. I've never really tried. I had a friend, she's in a band actually have a friend. She's in a band. Her and her husband, he, he, they rock. And she's like, you just, she says, everybody can sing. Cause I said, I can't sing. She's like, no, everybody can sing. I'm like, yeah, well maybe everybody can sing, but not good. And I'm not going to get my butt up there in front of people. And Oh man, I would probably pass out from sheer panic. All right, you guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. I had a lot of fun. I hope you guys have a really, really great weekend. I'm not sure I'll be on this weekend. I might, I might not. I'm not 100% positive yet. So if you found something you love, great. If not, thanks for joining. It was a good time. And there's more bags back there I forgot to show, but we'll just have to do that on another video. All right, guys, have a great, great, super fun weekend. Bye, guys.